What it do, y'all? It's your boy Shinobi Radix in here, and we are back with Vampire. I'm so excited to play this shit. I did not actually uh, hop back into it once I came back home from the last episode or from the last recording. Uh, I ended up falling asleep. I was actually really tired. It, it just hit me like out of nowhere, and I think it's uh, it was just a food coma. So I had some good food, but we're back. Um, it is nighttime outside so we got the mood going i'm all alone again uh for for a couple hours uh, my girl want to go and visit her Ooh, this is locked uh, i want to go visit her parents for a little bit so i'll probably knock out an episode or two uh the homeboys want to go ahead and play i'm assuming some apex so we might just record an episode and then head over there but we left off on where are we going the morgue yes the morgue go down here but are you guys enjoying the the let's play so far i know i am <laughs> really though i have been waiting to play this game and i am so glad that it was free uh, I need rats, because my blood is going down. Right. Now, I don't know if your... Where did it go? Oh, there it is. I don't know if your blood actually goes down over time. Oh, sh That's an enemy, I think. We don't have to go that way, do we? Well, what? I don't know what happened there, but no, I don't think we have to go... That way, I'm just going to go ahead and... No, sir, you don't see nothing. What does she have? Oh, shillings. Okay. Um, not going that way. Going to the morgue. But yeah, really, really glad uh, that we're playing this. And I, I, I genuinely am enjoying playing it. I... I might go ahead and just do like a separate playthrough, like on my own time, but I don't know yet. I, I want to get deeper into the story for this one because I don't want, you know, to like get into something like super, like, what's the word? Surprising. And then, you know, when I go to like to the actual let's play and it just it won't hit as hard or it probably won't i have no idea i cannot enter okay i i need to focus 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 where are we going wait is that how i get into my office yeah right or not because didn't he say we can get into my office through like the balcony or something I might be tripping. Dude, maybe I am. Because that is our office. I don't know. Okay, I'm getting distracted. There's just a lot of things that you can do in the game. And that, I mean, it's it's a toss-up <laughs> of whether or not it's good, good or not. Because I get so easily distracted. I think it is this way, right? No, we're getting further from it. Is it this building right here? Oh, wait. She said go through the alley, and it'll be a, a narrow alley, and then the door's going to be on the right, if I remember. Yes, yes, yes. This is the way. Oh, right here. Oh, wow. Uh, she definitely lied. We could have just gone through the back. All right. Oh, I was like, what the hell happened? All right, this loading screen is probably going to take a while. But um, I have no idea what we're going to upgrade. With games like these, I usually just focus on, like, one thing. But I still don't have, like, a good idea of what it is that we should start upgrading first. And I want to see if the blood actually does go down over time. Because if it does, that's probably going to be priority number one. Because there was an upgrade to... Um, increase blood capacity or the amount that you can hold. 
Wait. How did I gain that much blood? Do you gain, or not blood, but XP. Do you gain XP from the rats? Where am I? Oh, there's a bunch of shit in here. Uh, find some Ferose Tartrate. Ferrous Tartrate. Quinine Sodium Hypochlorite. Oh, man. This is some spooky stuff. Oh, no. People have definitely been in here. Some skulls, probably. Wait. Oh, no. That's downstairs. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm actually... What the fuck is that? I'm actually kind of fucking freaked out. I don't play horror games, and I know this is... I, technically, it's not one of those horror games where it's like, okay, you only got a flashlight. Uh, you know, collect this shit and, you know, try to survive. It's not that kind of... That's to go outside. Okay. It's not that kind of game. But this is some creepy shit. And because it's dark, I'm like, it's locked. What the hell? This is fine. It's nice and bright. I still don't see anything through the blood thing, so. Uh, anything in here? Shillings. Nice. Okay. Upstairs we go. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Okay. That's you. Is there another one over there? I don't know. Sneak attack, sneak attack, sneak attack. Got him. Oh, I missed. No. Oh, I should have bit him. It's okay. Hey, bitch. Get out of here. Oh, oh, oh. No, no, no. Fuck off. You know what? Fuck you. Oh, wait. I don't have enough. I don't have enough. Damn it. There you go. Fuck him up. Is similar to Fuck the yeah. William Bishops. Must be the same strain. Oh, I need that. This sickness moves faster oh, wait. than influenza. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blood samples. We need to start getting that stuff, I think. For, like, more, like, story progression stuff. I may be wrong, but I think so. Because the skulls are like, they're kind of like zombies in a way. Like they don't. This key will surely grant me access to the basement. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say it's probably the basement key. Um, but yeah, the the skulls are kind of more like zombies. They're kind of just go at it. Oh, he brought that up for. Oh shit! Oh man, that actually caught me off guard. I was fucking scared for a second there. Stun him! Stun him! Stun him! Oh wait, I need a switch. Yep. No. Stun him and bite his ass. What? What? Bite him. Okay, there you go. Oh my, he was pissing me off. Yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. I'm, I have to take the blood. I have to take the blood. Oh, I'm so bad. So bad at this game. Okay. Is this. Okay, can't go in there. We could go. Oh, Ooh, shoddy. Uh, nothing there. Do we go through this door? Or is this still locked? I cannot enter. Still locked. Okay. I uh, should have should have guessed that we just go down. Oh, wait. We can go up, right? Let's. Do we check this? Nope. Obviously not. Walls of Mars. Fortifiers. <laughs> as popular as they are ineffective. But. They do contain iron tartrate, and that might prove itself useful. Nice. I think everything up here is locked for now. Oh, no. Okay, more samples. Good, good, good. So now we just need to go down to the basement. Oh, um. Sir? Hello? Oh, no. I don't like this. I have fucking chills, man. Uh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's... Oh, um... No, 
go that, and then... Do I not have... The... Fucking shoddy equipped? Oh... Take space for that. Well, we got some shoddy shells, so let's... These scowls feed from corpses and the husks of animals. They're not ours. Ah, okay. That, okay. I was gonna say, I definitely thought that they just went, like, straight for blood, but I guess it's, like, the actual body parts and shit. Huh. Okay. Let's see. Homeboy went over there, right? The other one? Okay, yeah. That's a dead end, and there's nothing over there. Okay. Oh, he's fucking tweaking, dude. Come here. What? I definitely stuck up on him. That's some bullshit. Oh, hello. Oh, I barely got him. Hey, bitch. Come here. Oh, you teleport. Was that the one that I, was, I saw up there? I don't know, actually. Okay, um... We definitely need better weapons. Or I need to start upgrading, at least. Can I open this? No. Okay. Yeah, we need to start upgrading, and I need to get used to parrying. Let's go back to the site, because the site is good for that. There's another skull over there. Is this the way to go? Because wasn't there another way over here? Or was I tripping? No, there is. He's facing this way? No. No, he's not. He's fighting with himself. Oh, no. He's fighting to get in there. Oh, hello. And you're gone, sir. Thank you. Wait, give me your blood. Give me your sample. No, okay. Uh, we just came from here, right? I'm just gonna open all the doors. I'm lost. Come back here. Oh, I can open this. So we have to go to those double doors, I think. It's locked. It's, it's locked. locked. Yeah, nice. Used Liston knife. You just acquired a new type of offhand weapon. Equip and press triangle to direct. Oh, fuck yeah. Um, I that's the wrong button. Sorry. Give me that, sir. Thank you. We're definitely gonna upgrade the shit out of that. Oh, sorry, miss. Uh, that's locked. This connects to... Okay, this is... Okay, that's the room we came from. Okay, cool, 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 cool. See, that's why I like going around and kind of exploring a little bit because weapons and resources, stuff that's going to come in handy, you know, in the long run. Okay, nothing so far. Oh, there he- Oh! Alright, fucker. Come here. Come here. Oh, shit! What? I can't hit you. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Oh, you can only hit him as a shadow. Switch. No. I'm gonna fucking die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I can, I can dodge too, dumbass bitch. Yes, 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 yes. I have no idea if I'm actually like. Yes, give me some blood. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Oh no. I, yeah, use that, use that, use that. Okay, good, 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 good. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. I need blood. Thank you. Oh no, I need blood, sir. No, heal, heal, heal.
I'm low on blood, sir. I'm sorry. I'm just using this fucking butter knife. No, no, dodge that shit. Eat. Oh my god. What? I, I I was healing. Y'all saw that. Okay, I need to strategize. Cause I have no idea if I'm doing damage if I hit him or if I have to hit the shadow. But I mean I, I think I was doing damage when I was hitting him and not the shadow. But it's it's alright, it's alright, it's alright. we right. we will get it. I think we need to Whoa, whoa, okay, we need blood for sure. Uh, did that just take away all the progress? I don't think it did. Okay, stun you. No, fight him. Okay, oh shit. So, yeah, let's go back to getting some blood. Does dodging use blood? I don't think so. I don't think so. No, I don't think so. Oh, he... wait. We were already here, I think. I think. Uh... Okay, hold on. I excuse me, you will get your turn, sir. Okay, and then... Yes, 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 okay. okay. So we need to parry those fuckers with the scythe and then go in for the kill. Uh, did you guys drop anything? No. Okay. We also need to start crafting like potions and shit. Uh, will this give me... No. Okay. So resources I think don't respawn. You die. You're... I mean... Can I still sneak up on you like this? Oh, I can. Because you're stupid. Oh, uh, I'm stupid. Because... Can I bite you? Nope. Okay. Alright. Well, we kind of have an idea on how to go about this. Not really. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, yes, yes. You're ve very angry. Very Uh, I definitely dodged that, but that's okay. Oh, wait. His, okay, his... His shadow... Is the way that he attacks. Oh, no, sir. We cannot do that. No, thank you. What the... Okay, I okay, I I kind of I kind of get it. 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 Well, I parried you, sir. Y'all saw it. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Okay, you kind of have to like memorize his attack. Yeah, this was not a fight that we needed to lose like at all i was just stupid so yeah parrying definitely a life saver i'm not sure i can defeat them without becoming stronger yeah i definitely need upgrades it's so tempting definitely need upgrades okay so was that it is that everything because I don't think... Oh, wait. Yes, we can go up there. Oh, I guess we could have come up here to, like, heal up, right? Oh, never mind. Crafting. Okay. Yes. Analyze. Light blood serum. Regenerate 60 blood points instantly. 300. Uh, yes, sir. Give me that. Uh, I think that's that's it so far. Um, I, I want to upgrade this, please. You can upgrade your weapon to a new level with a crater. Okay, yeah. 
Oh, yep. Give me that. Level 2. Okay. Enhanced handling. Decreased stamina consumption by 10%. Uh, absorb blood points when the weapon hits. Oh, increase the... Okay. 2.5 blood points. Huh. Let's do that. And then we can't upgrade anymore. That's fine. Well, that's what that is, a stake. Uh, can we upgrade you? No. Okay, so for now, that's fine. And then, yeah, let's just recycle all this stuff. Can I upgrade you now? I don't think so. Yeah, none of that stuff was stuff that we could use like that. So how do I... Oh, never mind. They're automatically equipped. The button. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not going to go ahead and use the serum yet because I don't think we'll run into anything else. Right? I'm just going to keep this on just in case for a little bit. Uh, you were there before. Oh, hello, sir. Get up. Thank you. What? Who locked me in here? Oh, there's more. Are there more upstairs? I don't think so. Okay, so... Oh, I can't go in through here. Sneaky, sneaky. Maybe. I can sneak up on one of them. That's fine, though. I'll stun you. I'll bite you. Yep. And then use this. Give me that. Good shit. And then stun you. Oh. oh. Carry him, dumbass. Go. There you go. There you go. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Uh, let's switch. Switch. Oh, no. I just used that shit by, um, by accident. What a dumbass. What a dumbass. What a dumbass. Fight him. Yes. That's what I was trying to do initially. Oh, he did. Oh. Thank you. Yeah, what do you have, sir? Thank you. And you. Thank you. So, I think the scythe is the only thing that can go ahead and parry, right? I think so. Because I, I've i tried parrying with... Oh, no way. Yeah, yeah. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Because when you have the machete, you have the... The thing on the side. Okay, okay. I'm learning. I'm learning. This is all stuff we are like we had already like known, but my my slow brain ass cannot like comprehend sometimes. But it's cool. It's cool. That's gonna be the only death that of the entire run. I can guarantee it. Guarantee it. Actually, have we died already? No, 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 I don't think we have. I think that was the first first death. The only death. That or I can just cut it out and you guys would never know. Just kidding. I wouldn't do that. That's not a hideout, is it? No. I mean, it wouldn't have made sense if it was. Because we're right next to the hospital anyways. You, sir, what do you have? Uh, I'm looking for... No, I'm not. not looking for rats. We don't need any right now. So... Fast for fatigue. Sure. Oh, okay. We're back at the hospital. Okay. I was like, um... It's locked. We're locked. Okay. Your city needs you. Okay, cool. Sure. Uh, I, I'll talk to you later, sir. That's fine. All right. Where do I need to go for that, though? Back to my room? 
Yes, it looks like it. But I'm trying to figure out... Uh, whatever. Well, we'll figure it out later. Because I definitely remember Swansea saying... Because we, oh, we can talk to all these people, huh? Yeah, definitely going to do that later. Uh, but yeah, I definitely remember Swansea saying that we can get to our room through a window. But I... I mean, I tried looking for it. I tried exiting through here, through the window, and I didn't see anything, so. And I, I definitely thought it was this door, but you can't even open this door. So I have no idea. The flower's dying. It needs water. Yeah, I know, but I'm, I want to give it water, but how do I do that? The sink's right. That's not a sink. The sink's right here, but I, like, I don't, I don't know. Okay, first, we need to upgrade. We need to upgrade. I don't really use any of that. Making them defenseless. Okay. Increase health, increase stamina. Life regen, the damage. Blood capacity. Increase your blood absorption. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. This is the one we need. Yup. Yup. 600, we have enough. What? Oh, I have to be level 6. That is fine. Science, medical bags. You can now carry three serums on you. Increase the number of bullets you carry. I don't really think... Oh, I moved the mic, sorry. I don't really think we're going to need that right now oh tactical shadow veil uh five stamina used per second when walking 2.5 stamina standing still toggle drain your stamina to fade into the shadows and become invisible to most enemies moving in this state will drain more stamina you will exit shadows if you attack or dodge huh oh and there's ultimates level 10 okay what is this spring 20 damage. You perform a supernatural move to your target and cause damage upon landing. Huh. Huh. You drain your own blood and heal. Okay, yeah. Let's... Can I upgrade that? No. Level 6. Body condition... Let's do blood capacity. And I should have enough for this one too. Yep. I can do this too. Might as well. Perfect. And I think that should... That should give us a good amount of, like, leeway. Because the more we can carry, the better. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's a huge chunk. And we're going to be able to drain drain more blood. Okay, that's perfect. Okay, so uh, you have enough components to craft a medicine for fatigue. Uh, that's for anemia. Oh, fatigue. Nice. Uh, let's do another one of these. Because the guy at the pub... Uh, light regeneration serum regenerate. Okay, so we can make some of these. Perfect. Uh, my dumbass needs to remember do not hit the up button uh, to do that. Okay. So now we give it to the nurse because the nurse needed it. Bring the medicine to Dorothy. Yep. All right, all right. It's here, right? It's locked, all right. Is that not? Is that not it? It is. What? I cannot enter. Am I tripping? Is that not the... Hold on. Wait, what's that? Oh, in the patient's room. Then what's 
this other shit. Oh, nice shit. Merchant. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, so outside we go. Uh, where are the stairs? Right here. Alright, but I made the other one because the drunk kid. What? Is it just telling me to look at citizens? I think so. What's up, dude? Uh, I should have gone through the back, huh? Yeah. That's alright. Wait, no, it's still telling me. No, yeah, 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 yeah. It's through the back, through the back, through the back. But yeah, the the drunk guy at the at the pub. It showed that he needs one of those fatigue potions. So that'll probably give me like more info on what's his face. The the pub owner, Tom, right? I think so. Uh, was it back here? No, it's all the way back here. And then. Wait, no, this was the morgue. Unless she's over here. I might have just completely screwed that over. It's not this, is it? No. Why did I pull that out? See, because it's telling me to go in here. But for what? Did I miss something in here? Hold on, we'll, we'll, we'll check this real quick and then we can go back. It's fine. And then if more enemies spawn, I mean more blood, right? More blood. Well, no, not blood, but more enemies for more XP. Because I, I really don't want to take out, like, any civilians for the... Hold on. Yeah, so... Can I zoom in more? Why won't you... No, okay, re remove the custom marker. That's a hideout, okay. This map is janky as shit. Okay, that gives me the same thing, so I don't know why it told me to come back in here. I guess the game's tripping. But yeah, I'd, my goal is to not take out any civilians, because I... I feel like we don't really need to because I feel like we're going to get the opportunity to get all the upgrades eventually. But taking out the civilians is going to be a thousand times faster, you know? I mean, I just blew through what? Like 1,200? And then that one guy that we were supposed to save in the last episode, he was, what, two... I think it was 2,000. 2,000 blood? And he was only, like, halfway. So if he was all the way, that would have been 4,000 blood, or XP. I keep mixing those two up. But that would have been 6,000, or 4,000 XP. And we would have just mowed through <laughs> upgrades like that. What's in here? It's locked. Locked. Door. Everything's fucking locked. It's locked. Oh, never mind. Door. Oh, wait. A long ladder. Oh, man. Um. Well, okay, whatever. Oh! New him for Peppa. I guess we can do this real quick. Where are you at? Wait. Uh. I don't know. Peppa, hello. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening, Doctor. Oh, Lee. that camera angle is not good. This camera angle is not good either. That's as close as it's gonna get. Leaving the hospital, yes. Peppa, 
Are you sure you want to leave this hospital? To become a nurse as a little girl's dream. But in the end, I don't feel that useful. I want more. I want to make things change. Patients need you. This is unacceptable. Be proud of what you've achieved. Yeah, let's go with this one. You should be proud of what you've achieved. This hospital represents hope for many people in need of help. Maybe you're right. But at the moment, I feel like we're just a cemetery waiting room. Uh, you want to be more useful? What steps are you prepared to take to feel more useful? I don't know yet. My sister believes that the real fight is in the streets nowadays. Maybe she's right. Maybe this is what I must do. I probably definitely should have read that shit, but that's fine. Uh, what about mented hooks? Lost faith in your own. Let's if do that you one feel first. That saving lives is not useful enough. Perhaps it means that you've lost faith. On the contrary, my faith has never been stronger. Maybe we are all just too proud to face up to the fact that science cannot compete with God. Uh, I am. Uh... And what about Milton Hook? Does he share your point of view? For Milton, any change means more comfort and more peace. I disagree. Yeah, uh, change is not always, Goodbye. you know, the best thing in the world. Especially when it's like stuff like this. And I can only imagine what, like, back in the day, how they would feel. Because, I mean, nowadays, and, you know, with everything going on, it is very serious. But we have the tools at our disposal. When we have, like, the knowledge and the past experience, like, we, we've gone through this, you know, um, to go and just progress a lot faster than it was back then. I mean, they're, it you know, right. barely scratching the surface with a lot of things as far as, you know, trying to find methods that actually work and locked. trying to... Well, how do I get in? Wait. Wait. Investigate citizens' actions. Oh, she's down there. Oh, my. I should have just popped this shit um, as soon as I came in. But, okay, let, let's go investigate that shit real quick, and then we'll give uh, Dorothy shit. Uh, where, where were those two? Over there. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Uh, let's go outside. Because these two are beefing. Beefing to the max. Oh, uh, where are you guys? Inside? Oh, I can't even eat. Eat you. Okay. But yeah, let's go investigate this. Oh, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. I mean, uh, during this time, I mean, they. Science was like so new that really like what what more could have been done you know oh wait i need to go in here before that finally shit. you've returned doctor did you find anything of value yes nurse you've worked your first miracle doctor now this patient here needs immediate treatment we'll do we got him when the storm has passed i'll show you how to mix the remedy yourself with the same basic ingredients many thanks doctor when you've finished, you ought to report to Dr. Swansea in his office. He's been looking for you. Seems pressing. Uh, uh, diseases. Diseases decrease the blood quality of a citizen. Use the correct medicine to heal them. Speak to the patient in the room behind Dorothy to check his medical status. Will do. Where was the interaction? In here, right? Yeah. Uh, you're the wife. Let's talk evening, to you real ma quick. Can I help you? It's my son who needs you, sir. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. How can I help your son? I'm Beatrice Goswick, mother of Mortimer Goswick. Could you check on him, please, Dr. Reed? I've heard much of your talents as a physician. Sure have. Uh, your life in London. Oh, all right. 
Uh, tell me about yourself. Can you tell me about yourself? That's the question. Not much to say. Just take care of my Mortimer, and I'll cover all the expenses. That's all that matters. I mean, you're right. May I ask if you have an occupation, Mrs. Godfrey? I'm a teacher by profession. I teach young women who are more ambitious about their futures than their families. Oh, good. Nice. Are you really that rich? Most of the patients here are of a more humble origin, if I may say. Yes. Thanks to my husband. He's a fool. I can cover any needed medical expenses. You killed that fucker. I already know it. of your reception here. Any complaints? I have had the uttermost reservations about this hospital since we arrived. But we had no other choice, considering the state of emergency. Is there something in particular that's bothering you? Some of the staff were not especially welcoming. I suspect they're not accustomed to dealing with patients of such social standing. Uh, I bet you Tell was me more Milton. About your arrival at the Pembroke Hospital. What gave you such a bad first impression? The ambulance driver was quite rude. Fucking knew it. Upset. And that nurse, Miss Dawkin, seems to have quite a dubious attitude. What do you mean? She managed to secure a bed for my son despite the epidemic. It was a relief, but it wasn't cheap. Ah. She charged you for a bed? Yes, and I paid without question considering the urgency of the situation. They're trying to flee. I share your concern, Mrs. Godfrey. Be sure that I'll talk to the people involved. I don't expect compensation, Dr. Reed. But I'm aware such behavior would not be tolerated in other hospitals. All right, don't worry. I'll, I'll take care of that shit. Uh, personal questions. Okay. Well, I guess we're done Goodbye, here. Uh, I guess I can treat your son. I like how we just had that conversation like nothing. And the son's like dying. Good evening. I'm Dr. Reed. Can I help at all? No. Really? No. <laughs> okay. Why are you here? I don't want to talk. My throat hurts too much. I oh. suppose that this pain is the reason you're here. Is someone taking care of you? Yes. And no. Could you at least tell me your name, sir? Mortimer. Mortimer Goswick. Okay. Uh, press R1 to check the medical status of the citizen. Healing a citizen will increase his blood quality and will reward you with XP. The health status of the district will also improve. Okay, cool to know. Uh, you said L1? No, R1. Do you need any help? I'm afraid I may have, sir. I don't mean to be a burden. Uh, don't give medicine. Yeah, fuck yeah, give you him the medicine. The what the hell? Sir. Healing you is my responsibility. And you have my gratitude for that. Sir, yes, sir. Uh, so tell me about yourself, Mortimer. Tell me about yourself, Mr. Godfrey. I don't want to talk, Doctor. That's fine. I understand. Uh, yeah. How painful How is your throat? How painful is your throat, Mr. Godfrey? So painful I'd rather not talk at all, Doctor. Oh my. Okay. Uh. I'm sure you realize a doctor and his patient have to communicate sir would it help if i gave you some paper and a pen not really i see then maybe it's not just your throat that hurts mr godfrey perhaps your sore throat is just the consequence of something more hurtful yes maybe. Uh -huh. but i don't want to talk really right about it now uh, we're getting deeper Why into it have you hospitalized here she seems convinced this is a bad hospital. My mother just wants the best for me. If she won't rest while I'm here, she'd go all the way to hell and back to take me. I feel like it is the is mom. Is your mother bothering you? As your doctor, I can ask her to leave you alone if you would prefer. That's tempting, Doctor. But you have no idea what my mother is capable of. She would tie herself to my bed if it were up to her. I'd, I'm telling you, she Pembroke fucking off the husband. Patients, but rest assured, you're in good hands here. What may you have to convince Dr. Reed? It's my mother. Yeah, the mother's a fucking bitch. Well, I, I think I already asked him everything. I'll let you rest, bro. Don't hesitate to contact me. 
if you need any help. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You're good. Uh, Peppa, give me some of that cut, bitch. Uh, remember, Citizen's Blood will provide you a massive XP boost. Look for Citizen's. If you're mesmerized, level or below, choose wisely. All right. Oh! Hold on. What's this bitch at? Uh, 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 uh. Fuck. Four? Once we're forward, off in that bitch. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just... Uh... I want to, but I, I don't think that's, like, the actual move. Oh, yeah. Peppa, give me some of that cut. Good evening, Master. Good evening, Dr. Reed. Personal questions. What? Your life in London? Um. I mean, did we not? I don't think we're healthy. Yeah, did we not just get a hint from the mom? Goodbye, Master. Or was it Dorothy? No, she she definitely said Hawkins. Anyways, uh, Milton fucked up too. Where's he at? Oh, what is my man's doing out there, bro? He's like skibbity boop bopping away. Uh, Milton. Where are you, sir? Uh, yeah, where are you? Beatrice Gons Wick. Oh, hold on. Are they beefing? I think they are. Where's Milton? Milton. Seriously, where the... Oh, sir. Hold on. I can help you. Good evening, Mr. Cox. Dr. Reed. Still working at night, I see. I like that. And why is that? People who don't sleep at night always seem more alive to me. More interesting, one way or another. I I agree. You um, must be alive, Mr. Cox. I hope you're starting to take better care of yourself. This place is too sick to be cat. How could I get better in such a dump? I got you, boy. Consider yourself lucky. I'm treating all of my patients equally. But don't forget your roots. Don't play the innocent with me. I'm sure you have good reasons to act this way. And also weaknesses that can be exploited. Oh, does he know? Uh, I'll talk to you later. For now. But I, I'm going to keep my eye on that fucker. Hey, fuck you two doing? Shagging. Good evening, Milton. Good evening, Doctor. Still trying to save lives. Uh, yeah. But let me ask you something, buddy. Do you know that Nurse Hawkins is thinking of leaving the hospital? That's not a surprise. We've talked about it already. Does it not bother you? Sometimes I think you may be right. We should run away while we can. You d I'm on top of this we fucking shit. I should just be a We're fucking detective. Safe. I knew they're trying to fucking run. Um, is that it? Goodbye, Milton. Well, I mean, oh, fucking Peppa just disappeared. She's a fucking vampire, too. Uh, Peppa! I swear we got a hint for her. I know we did. I'm not imagining that shit, I don't think. Excuse me. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening, Dr. Reed. Yeah, okay. Hello, hello. Uh, personal questions. What the... Dude, I must Goodbye, be Master. tripping or some shit, but I definitely remember her saying that she had to pay her. Or was it Dorothy? Was it? Doctor Reed, may I help you? Personal question. Uh, general question. Mm. I'll see you later, Nurse Cranks. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. I'm not gonna hold up on it too much. They were just like doing an interaction. Oh, and I could talk to you. Okay, whatever. 
Uh, Swansea, that's second floor. Second floor, second floor. A rat in the hospital. Yeah, I know who. There's two, buddy. There's not just one. Rats with an S. Uh, Swansea, 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 Swansea. Oh, never mind. I think he's all the way up top. Mm, oh, wait. I see him. I saw him. He is over here somewhere. Uh, oh, is it right here? Yep. Please, Jonathan, come in. I fucking love this dude. Fascinating, is it not? In the last decade, so many mysteries have been brought to light with our microscopes. The human body. Biology's penultimate frontier. The more we explore its boundaries, the less we're able to trace a clear line between life and death. <laughs> you, my friend, have a foot in both countries. The view must be vertiginous. It's at least as vertiginous as chatting about vampires with you, I would say. Huh. This must be all so new to you. This area of town, the hospital, a brand new life. How stimulating it must be. I wish I could share your enthusiasm, Dr. Swansea, but my condition defies scientific categorization. Undead? Unalive? Immortality defies logic. I cannot express my thrill at this serendipitous turn of events. The world's most eminent specialist in blood transfusions, a vampire. Yeah. <laughs> One might say a gift from heaven. You fucking shit. Uh, this is no gift. Your words bring comfort. I'm living a paradox. Yeah, there definitely. There is an absurd poetry to my situation. Physician, heal thyself. Forgive me. I've been an admirer of your work for a long time, and now you are so much more than a brilliant physician. And please, call me Edna. All right. No need to apologize. This is not amusing. We need each other. Uh, no need to apologize. There's you, no you need to apologize, me. Edna. You offered me sanctuary when I had none. Very well. I have a task for you, Jonathan. Something that will require all your newfound skills. Please, go on. The Pembroke only survives through the generosity of our benefactors. Unfortunately, our main donor has found herself in a bit of a bind. Now, if you could uh -oh. help her out. A spokesman or politician is what she needed. That's not my calling. And until I come to understand what has happened to me, I require discretion. Discretion is in order, Jonathan. Lady Ashbury has recently received rather indelicate correspondence that, if revealed, would jeopardize her position. And you would like me to eradicate this threat? By the soul, of course not. I would just like you to pay her a visit. <laughs> her ladyship is certainly near the tents outside, tending the sick. You can't miss her. Look for someone impossibly delicate. Accepted. I'll see what kind of trouble Lady Ashbury is in. All right. Let's go get that bag from Miss Ashbury. I think Swansea's okay. I think we can trust him. I mean, I don't really see why we wouldn't. I mean, I get he, like, kept the other hoe a secret. But I think that was to really just benefit himself or keep himself safe. Oh, it's her! Look, my dear wife, Emily. I take comfort knowing we'll soon be together again. Mr. Renfield, that's no way to talk. You're in good hands here, and we'll be up again soon. Renfield, that, that's funny. Renfield was uh, Dracula's like henchman. Get some sleep. I'll be back round later. Your words are kind. The blessings of an angel with a sweet, sweet lady of mercy. Wait, is that her, or does she just look like her? Good evening, Doctor Ord. It's a pleasure to see you again. Ah, it is. You seem surprised. Doctor Swansea has brought me up to speed concerning your recent appointment. Okay, now I trust him a lot more. You're a vampire. The lady who saved me that night. Before vanishing into thin air. 
I remember you from the pub with Dr. Swansea. Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself formally this time. My name is Lady Ashby. I remember you well, in spite of the brevity of our encounter. I'm glad to see you. I feel played. Swansea fancies vampires. Uh, glad to see you. Apologies. You've taken me by surprise. I'm very happy to see you. The pleasure is mine, Doctor. I hope you're more disposed to answer my questions now. You must have countless questions, but I rather urgent matter first. Swansea has explained. My cover, if you prefer, has been compromised. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, patrons have given you trouble. I have questions about vampires. Uh, no, let, let, any of the patients give me let's trouble. work with her for a little These bit first. These poor souls have so little left to live for. I do my best to ease their pain. Do I believe her? Yeah, yeah, I do. I wouldn't have believed her if she's not working with with Swansea and she's kind of like on her own agenda but she has saved us twice now I guess I guess the first time she saved us was when this whole shit like started um yeah I, I, I believe her place if it were cared for by women like you you make me blush I am simply a necessary evil yeah I I guess so uh let's not Piss her off. Let's Dr. just Swansea get straight to it. Commissioned me to be your agent in this matter. If you could start by explaining what's amiss. These past insufferable weeks, I've been the victim of extortion. I've made a first payment, but the blackmailer grows greedy. I must pursue his most recent demand. Uh, what do you want from me? Why not solve this yourself? Is another vampire threatening you? I don't think it's another vampire. Well, actually, these are these are good questions, so what let's just ask them. Please be precise. As the newly appointed surgeon of this hospital, you are in an excellent position to ask innocent questions and deftly learn the identity of my blackmailer. Okay. Uh, why not solve this if yourself? We're dealing with an ordinary criminal. Surely you need the means to deal with it yourself. As immortal tradition doth dictate, all fangs and hypnotic eyes ablaze. The blood would run like a river. That's what I hope to avoid. Ah, so it might be a vampire. Tendency to spiral out of control. I think it is a vampire. Who would be so foolish as to threaten you, a kindred spirit? Even if it were the case, and I highly doubt it, a vampire would have asked for something more valuable than money. My suspicions lean toward a patient or their family. It's fucking Hawkins and Milton. Please continue. Every detail is essential. I'm your man. My embarrassment in this matter is eclipsed only by my shame at having put the hospital at risk. The threat from our anonymous scoundrel is clear. A list of dates. My visits coinciding with the dates of suspicious patient deaths due to massive blood loss. Huh. Is it true? I'll take care of it. Uh, I want to gain her trust, so I'll say I'll take care of it. I really don't think she's coming in here and just taking their blood. Uh, but this one's kind of a shot in the dark. Uh, yeah, I'll take care of it. I'll take care of it. Do you know where I should start? If that was the case, I'd settle the matter myself. You could talk to our local gossip, Harriet Jones. Not a pin drops here without her hearing about it. Harriet Jones, got it. Now. My life, as others know, is in your hands, Dr. Reed. I'm sure of your discretion, but I do fear your powers of persuasion will be put to the test. 
when it is resolved, I'll be your obligé. I'll answer all questions in regards of your condition. Okay, so I feel like we made the correct decision in just fully trusting her. Because, um, I mean, our end goal is to figure out what the hell happened to us anyways. So that's, that's fine. I, I feel like we, we made the, the right move here. Um, we're going to go ahead and actually end off the episode here. Because uh, the homeboys are asking to play some, some Apex, and I am down. Because <laughs> um, right now it's the, what is it, Fright or Fight? A game mode up and that shit is really fun um i actually have quite a bit of clips already so that's definitely gonna be an episode but other than that hope you guys enjoyed this episode i love this game i hope you guys are loving it just as much as i am i hope y'all are getting into the characters as much as i am same thing for the story the story is good the story i feel like it was good to put us in the same position as him and not have any kind of like background info on what's going on because it makes us it makes us want to talk to everybody and actually use that mechanic and get some more insight on stuff and it, it leads to like theories because now i'm thinking okay if these guys are asking her for money it's got to be hawkins and milton because they're planning to run away and hawkins is over here you know selling beds for you know double the price or some shit um but really, really cool game. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, if you are, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe for the next episodes that are coming up and for some extra content. Um, Y'all already know that Apex video is going to be coming up, but I have other stuff planned uh, for the future. Um, but until then, um, I will see y'all in the next video. Peace. Baby, I'm always on the grind, I gotta get it Crazy, I got the city rocking with me, Daisy. So